Hi, my name is Caroline Barry and I'm the author of The Dollager, a novel published by Black and White Publishing. The novel has been inspired by an 18th century ghost story. It's set in Dublin and part of the ghost story is that a man called Oliger commits suicide. He was due to be hung. He commits suicide and then returned back from the dead. And he returned back from the dead as a demon, um, an amalgamation of half man, half pig. He haunted the prison initially, and then he went out into the streets of Dublin and began attacking women. So in my novel, I have a main character called Merriment O'Grady. She's a middle-aged woman. She's been a surgeon at sea and has now opened up an apothecary shop on Fishamble Street, desperate to change her life. And she's finding it very hard settling into this new life that she has made for herself. Into that life comes a little girl called Janie Mack. And also into that life, a man walks into her shop one day, a handsome man in his late 20s who happens to be a broadsheet writer and his name is Solomon Fish. Now, the young girl that she's adopted convinces Solomon Fish to take a room in Merriment O'Grady's house. And almost instantly, instantly there's this haphazard family unit formed. And as they become more and more engaged with the Dollager story, their own backstories begin to be revealed. Solomon is very interested in this notion of a demon out there. And you've got to remember, Dublin was really, really poorly lit at the time. There were only pitch street lamps. And in that incredible darkness, it was highly probable that a demon could emerge because the darkness then was a very, very different darkness to what we know now. So Solomon is writing about this demon and Merriment is questioning, well, what can this really mean? You know, we're, we're at the age of enlightenment. Can a demon really exist? And as they become more and more engrossed with the Dollager, something begins to happen. It seems that the Dollager is very interested in them. So I do hope that you'll buy the novel and find out why the Dollager is interested in Solomon Fish and Merriment O'Grady.